Welcome to Gray Tools, a century-old business in Brampton, Ontario, that reached a turning point and took the plunge to enter a new market. For entrepreneurs, expanding into a new market, whether in Canada or abroad, is usually motivated by a desire to generate new growth or compensate for a shrinking customer base in an existing market, or both. In the case of Gray Tools, which manufactures high-end tools for professionals, the trigger was Asian importers arriving in Canada with low-cost products and taking a cut of its profits. There really was a marketplace in Canada that we weren't servicing. We recognized that on the high price point line, we had a lot of penetration in Canada. As such, we started looking for uh, a line of, of import tools of our own. Entering a new market is full of challenges, and planning ahead is essential. Before starting, you should make sure your company's fundamentals are in order and that you fully understand your new market. Base your strategy on solid research to ensure added value, and be persistent, because first-time success is never guaranteed. We could have gone and gotten an, a line out of uh, Asia quickly, sure. uh, picked off the shelf, and took whatever quality was there. Yeah. But of course, we're backing it with a lifetime guarantee and with the great name. And what we need to do is guarantee quality. And, and that was a, that took a long time for us. Right. About four years worth from oh, beginning. Four years. Oh, yeah. It was four years from of work. Validation that the opportunity yeah. existed yeah. to validation that you could actually unravel or develop sure. a program uh, to actual inception. Oh. When entering a new market, it's essential to understand the needs of your new clients. You may have to redesign your product or service and adapt your strategy, operations and marketing to the new market conditions. The great brand name, when we did our studies, meant something. It had yes. certain associations and perceptions right. mm -hmm. and we felt that to tackle a different segment uh, required a new brand name, a new look, a new logo. Uh, we knew that long term that yeah. would be the greatest way for success for both the Gray brand okay. and what now is known as our dynamic line of tools. Okay. While diversification is one of the challenges of entering a new market, it can also be one of the great benefits, helping your organization increase its stability and facilitate growth. For Gray Tools, having two separate brands gave the company access to new distribution points. So what we ended up finding was that they complemented each other. Uh, it gave the distributors more of a one-stop shop to be able to handle both the high price point and medium price point marketplace in their area. And launching the dynamic line has also forced us to reevaluate, look at the gray line and push ourselves further to find differentiation right. to make it better. With both brands now enjoying double-digit growth, Great Tools is a success story to inspire other entrepreneurs. It's proof that entering a new market can both reinvigorate a company and promote its growth. And that means taking time to understand the market, properly adapting your product, and being both patient and determined. BDC is the only bank dedicated exclusively to entrepreneurs. 